All right, hey, what's up guys? Um, I just hit 100 YouTube subscribers, so I'm gonna give you guys a tutorial on how to make a website that uh, makes no fucking sense, and then you share it for no reason at all. Uh, okay, so first thing you gotta do is to get a pop open your um, terminal. We're gonna make a new directory called tguytom.com, and we're gonna cd into tguytom.com. All right, boom, we're good, we're in. Next thing we do is we're gonna put a VS code because we're gamers. And we know what we're doing. And now we're in. Now we got our directory in. Now we're ready to go. Next we're gonna install Next.js because any good T guy worth their salt uses Next.js. It's just, that's just a given. So we'll take it right off their site and we're gonna use the latest build because we're not trying to use some old nonsense, come on. We'll put a period here to reference a local directory and then we'll tell it to use npm because we're not we're not using yarn. Come on, what are we doing? What are we doing here? I mean for real. And we'll go for that. Boom. We're in. We'll let that install, pull all that down. Would you like to use TypeScript? I mean, what are we doing? <laughs> what are we like? What is this, 2004? Like of course we're gonna use TypeScript. Yes, Lint? Come on. What are we doing? Come on. This ain't T-Guy's first game. I mean, come on. If you're a real T-Guy, you're using TypeScript. Everyone already knows that. Any proper T-Guy out there is gonna lint their project because it's, it's, no, it's no point in even making a T-Farm if you can't lint your code. I mean, you know what I mean? Let's just write a little H2. T-Guy Tom. Let's double check that we get in there. Boom, T-Guy Tom. Great, we're gonna jump on Twitter real quick. Hit it with a little, like, on top. GG. Just tweet that real quick. Just get that out there in the world. All right, then we'll jump over here. We'll hit a little active. Let's do a background white. Yeah, let's get real seizure with it. We gotta hype it up a bit. So when you click that shit, it's gotta do something. You know what I mean? Like you can't just sit there. It's gotta like do a thing. So we're gonna add some effects. All right, so first thing we need, we need to install some stuff. So right out the gate, we got to install Canvas Confetti. All right, so now that we have it installed, we got to import it into our library. So up here, we're going to bring this in. Now that we got that imported, we could just swag it up all day. So we'll import that. All right, now we have to animate our, our confetti. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to call I'm gonna make a function called animate confetti. Oh, messed up my arrow function again. Come on, rook. Now we're returning that. We can then fire off this get animation instances, and then we'll see what this does. Excellent. All right, so we need to add two because one is not enough. So we'll slide this one over a little bit, put one down at the bottom here. And this should. All right, I'm feeling it. This is the way a tea farmer celebrates. So what we're gonna do next is we're gonna use our cell, and we're gonna deploy this. Perfect. Now that that's deployed, then we go to tguytom.com, and we celebrate. Thanks again for 100 YouTube subscribers. Uh, this is crazy that any of you guys follow me. Um, feel free to come to this page and celebrate. I don't know. I have no idea what to do here. This is all weird for me. So um, I'm going to be making more tea farms. Um, yeah, I don't know. Tea is life. GG's.